on the atomic layer deposition and molecular layer deposition and their applications in lithium ion, sodium ion batteries and all solid state batteries. As a novel gas phase approach, atomic layer deposition techniques have been rapidly developed over the past decades. The ARD process is defined as the self-limiting surface reactions that can deposit ultra-thin films at their atomic level on high surface area substrates. As an extension of ARD, molecular layer deposition has been further developed by replacing the oxidizing precursor with organic linkers. In the past years, different types of MLD thin films have been developed, including the pure polymer thin films and organic, inorganic hybrid films of metal cone. Compared with atomic layer deposition, molecular layer deposition shows more advantages like high layer flexibility, lower density, and a tunable mechanical property. All these advantages allow this technique can be used in some specific energy-related applications which can give more promising properties. On one hand, MLD technique can be used to fabricate organic electrodes for flexible batteries or supercapacitors. On the other hand, the MLD thin films are used as a template to fabricate nanomaterials by different post treatments. In Dr. Sam's group, we have developed different MLD thin films for different applications. Meanwhile, we have the MLD machine coupled with Glowbox, which allows us to do surface modification on air-sensitive samples, like lithium metal, sodium metal, and other air-sensitive electrodes. Our group firstly demonstrated an aluminum coating directly on the sulfur cathode, which can significantly improve the cycling stability and the capability of the lithium sulfur batteries. Particularly, it also can make the carbon sulfur electrode working very well in a carbonate-based electrolyte at high temperatures. We also use aluminum as protective layer for both lithium metal and sodium metal anode, which can prevent the reactions between the alkaline metal and electrolyte, surprise the dendrite growth and longer the lifetime of the metal. Besides battery application, this novel technique has also been studied in other energy-related applications, including catalyst, fuel cell, solar cell, and membranes. We believe with continued efforts, MLD technique can offer more solutions to address the current issues and problems in the energy-related applications, including the energy storage and conversion. Thank you.